Hey, what's up? Join us to Science here with a little Sony Vegas tutorial. Uh, it's a color correction on uh, I did on a previous video called uh, Black Ops Color Correction and Frag Test. I think uh, you can uh, if you want to see the video, you can just click the screen right now. You'll be hanging there. So to create this effect, we're gonna use a plugin called uh, AAV Color Lab, which you have to get. Uh, so you just go to the description and click the link. And you'll be thinking to this site right here, and you just download the one that's uh, good for you, like I uh, have 32 bit. Yeah, so download that and install that, and then we can just go to Vegas. I personally use uh, Vegas Pro 9, but you can use 8, uh, I don't know, maybe 7, but I uh, I would recommend 9 because I think it's the best and has some good effects. Okay. So now we're in Vegas, we can just import our clip. So take this clip right here and just drag it in. So here we go, here's my clip. And so the first thing you want to do is add a uh, color curves color correction. So just take that right there and drag it on to your clip. Now, what you want to do with this line here is you want to take the the lower square square or whatever it is down here and drag it down pull it down a little make it make the dark even darker and you want to do the opposite with this little thing up here drag it up to make the light even lighter so now if we just uncheck it you'll see it's really gray from the beginning but when we add color curves it's much more like alive and we made that much difference in just that little of an effect, yeah. So I recommend you to use it on every clip you have, because it's just it's just awesome. Then you can go to AV Color Lab right here and drag it onto a clip. Uh, it's pretty good to have a red a, a clip with much red in it, and uh, because uh, well, it can be any color, but it's usually red, and I'll use red. So what you want to do? is go to AV Color Lab and you you wanna click this and choose green. You're gonna drag the saturation down. So it desaturated the green right now. We're gonna do the same with the blue and the cyan the magenta and the yellow. So now you can only see uh, the red and like the orange like colors and so that's what we're aiming for at the moment so we desaturated all the colors but red so now we want to saturate red even more to make it more clearly visible okay so we just take this saturation right here and just drag it up to pull up the saturation a bit to like 190 around there it's pretty good and we're gonna Put the light lightness up too. Okay, we might mi might wanna take down the saturation a bit more. Both of them. So the other colors are kinda black and white. So you see, like here, they're black. And white. <clears throat> so now we can take this, the hue here, and change it from red to whatever color we want. So then the red in the video is gonna change uh, when we change this. So uh, in the Black Ops video, I changed it to blue, so we're gonna change it to blue. Now you can see everything uh, that was red is now blue. So we can just now we can play around with the lightness and saturation a little more to make it even more uh, clear blue. Like maybe pop up the saturation a bit, the lightness, maybe. Can play with the color curves a little. Mm. And just keep doing this till you get something that's kind of good. Like here, every, every color but blue is now um, black and white. Maybe gotta take the lightness up. And now, when we look at the clip, oh shit, we can see that. It's blue. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. 
and be sure to check out my v other videos rate comment and subscribe uh, so I'll see you later maybe yeah I'll see you later